Hi, I'm Simon Lipkin and I am so excited to be bringing you the first studio live lecture on Alakazam Unlimited on the 30th of April. Join us. Here's what's going to happen. The 30th of April, sign into your Alakazam Unlimited account and join us for a studio live lecture. You'll be able to interact with me, ask questions, be involved. But if you can't be there, don't worry. This thing is going onto the Alakazam Unlimited platform for you all to watch whenever you want. So if you can be there on the 30th, ask questions, get a hands-on take of what's going on, then do that. If not, sit back, relax, and enjoy it whenever you want. And guess what? This thing doesn't cost you a single penny more. For the same price that you pay for Alakazam Unlimited, you will be able to watch this new studio live lecture with me, Simon Lipkin. Harry, I am an actor, right? Mm -hmm. uh, and over, I've been in musicals and films and all of that sort of stuff. And over these years, I feel like I can get a hunch of what type of thing people like. Okay. Whether it be a song, whether it be actors, whether it be films, right? Yep. So in fact, let's let's try some stuff. Right. Okay. okay. So uh, I've got a playlist here. Uh, this is 500 songs to listen to before you die. Right. Okay. There's all sorts of classics on there, mm -hmm. right? There's a lot of songs that we'd all know the words to. So just give it a big old scroll. Yep. Okay. And look at a song in there that you would know the words to and you think maybe a group of people would know the words to. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Lock the got phone. So yep. Is that locked? Yep. Perfect. Okay, good. So write that down, Harry. So we've got proof of your choice. <laughs> okay. So you can't lie to me. Right. Because this is the worst thing in the world when you try and read someone's mind and then they go, got you. Yeah. Okay, nope. fold that up. Okay. Okay, so you're thinking of a song, right? Yes. So yep. now grab another one and maybe maybe go for that film. That film that you love, that you have watched a lot, that you care about, that on a Sunday you put that film on and you're thinking, God, this makes me feel happy. You can viscerally feel something when you're thinking about that film. Okay. Okay. Right. Good. Fold that up. Happy, yep. And now lastly, think of an actor, an actor that you love, an actor that you admire, respect, love their work. Maybe not in the film that you've just picked, because I might be able to link those okay. two. But grab that last one and write down an actor that you really, maybe you want them to play you in a movie. Maybe you think that they're great and they're a, a, a great role model, or maybe it's just someone you fancy. Whatever you want it to be, write that person down, fold it up and put it down with the other bits of paper. Right, I've absolutely ruined their name, but we'll see. Okay, that's all <laughs> okay. right. Good. So, mix those bits of paper up for me. Okay. Yep. Happy. Perfect. Happy, happy, happy. Yep. Okay. Absolutely. Good. So, let's start here. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this, I might be wrong. I'm not entirely sure what now is where, but I've got a feeling that this might be the song that you're thinking of. Okay. Okay, so um, think about whether this is a female artist, male artist, a band. Okay, good, so a male artist, yes. Yeah. Okay, yeah. good. Uh, so, um, but, but when I said band as well, there was sort of a little bit of a reaction in you, which makes me think that maybe it's not a band, but it might be more than one person or a collaboration or, or yeah. someone that plays with a lot of people. Um, uh, now, here's the thing. The reason why I get you to choose something off of a list first is because I need to start to understand how you work, how you think, right? right? Okay. Even though there's 500 songs on there, I, I, I can vague, I made the list, right? So I can vaguely remember most of them. So okay. now I've narrowed you down to try and get tells, to try and understand you. I think you said it's a male artist collaboration, which makes me think you've probably gone for Bruno Mars Uptown <laughs> Funk. Yeah, that's yes, the one. okay, good. So <laughs> let's move on to this one. There you go. Uh, so this, I think now, are you checking it? Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's Uptown Funk. Yeah. Um, so this now, I'm pretty sure, is the film. Uh, this is going to be harder because it's something that you care about, something that you love. Yep. Um, you're giving less away now, which makes it harder. So let's come back to that. Okay, let's go for this is, I'm assuming is the actor. Uh, someone that you like. I made you deliberately think about someone that you respect, someone that you'd want to play you in a film. I said someone that you might fancy, right? So you're going to think that this is an attractive person. I would assume you would have gone for a, a, a man, a, a, a male actor. Mm -hmm. um, uh, 
so someone that you would have cared about who would have you grown up maybe watching like a magic mic somewhere around there <laughs> that, uh, someone that you were respected so i don't think it's going to be like a hemsworth or someone i think you're cooler than hemsworth so my gut is this is probably either a ryan reynolds or a mcconaughey or a mcconaughey yeah yeah, yeah McC McC mcconaughey okay good let's try this last one there you go um so the last one is uh, is that film um Okay, a film that would have been cool when you were younger. When we think of films that we love, we think of films that were younger. You're like 23, 24? 23, 23. Yeah, yeah. So I'm thinking it's probably early. Uh, a Paul Rudd film. It's probably not going to be a comedy. You like something darker than that. I think probably maybe a Scorsese film in that. Your Scorsese film, good. <laughs> uh, okay, so I think. You're a Leonardo, Leonardo DiCaprio fan? Yeah. Is there. <laughs> Is that Shutter Island? <laughs> yeah. Open it up. Yeah, yeah, have a look, have a look, have a look. Shutter Island. So, yeah, bang on. Go. How the hell? So here's what I'm gonna show you. For those of you that don't know me, I'm a mentalist. And I love simple, bold, effective mentalism. Stuff that you know is gonna work every single time that you perform it. I am gonna teach you uh, three envelope test, but without the envelopes, no extra billets. If you are new to mind reading and billet work, this is the perfect routine for you. It utilizes an incredible move, which is gonna serve you so well in all areas of mentalism. And it's gonna leave you with a routine with three huge hits for three different spectators that packs a punch. This is a proper worker. You can use it, I use it all the time when I'm out gigging and working, and I cannot wait to teach it to you. I'm gonna teach you how to make some utility devices that will serve you in so many routines. The routine that I'm gonna teach you is sort of a combination of a close-up chair test prediction free will effect, but this thing you can use, customize it to whatever suits you best, to however you wanna make this work. And it's gonna take you seconds to make with stuff that you absolutely will have right by your side to begin with, and I cannot wait for you to learn this. I'm gonna teach you a brand new marking system for a deck of cards. Not playing cards, any information that you wanna put on a deck of cards that you will then be able to mark and know exactly what that spectator is thinking of. They shuffle, they deal, everything is in their hands. They can then put that deck away and you will have everything that you need to know to be able to get inside their minds and perform miracles. My name's Simon Lipkin, and I cannot wait for you to join me on the 30th of April at the very first studio live lecture on Alakazam Unlimited. Be there or be Alaka Square. Hi guys, and welcome to this week's Alakazam Live. And that is gonna be amazing. It's our first unlimited lecture happening on the 30th of April. If you're an unlimited member, you can gain access on the night through unlimited. Um, if you're not a member, why not? It's $4.99 a month, and you get access to over 150 videos. So, uh, because that was a long trailer, I didn't realise it was that long. I'm going to introduce you to my co-host, the fantastic Mr. Wayne Goodman. Hello. Here he is. How are you? Got my hoodie on. You have got your hoodie on. Looking slick. I thought about going for a jog this morning. I didn't, but I thought about it. And it's a thought that counts, isn't it? It is. 100%. So how are you, Wayne? What have you been up to? I've had a, yeah, it's been good. I've had a busy weekend. Um, it's been exciting. Uh, oh, oh yes, you've, you've had a very busy weekend, haven't you? I've been away. 
Yeah. yeah. We Just took to Harry away. You, back to the... you want me? Back, back to the homes. Yeah. Went to Italy, took Harry away for his birthday. Now, I will apologise. Wayne's having internet issues, so he's glitching a little bit. Um, but, yeah, we took Harry away. Me, Jenny, Harry, Holly and Holly's fiancé went away to Italy, which was very nice. Thank you very much. Weather was amazing and food was always good. Um, so how old is Harry now? 24. 24? Oh, my God. The little He's boy literally wonder. half my age. <laughs> He's literally half my age. That's depressing. Yeah. <laughs> well... Yeah, when he when he was born, Alexan was already running for ten years. Yeah. Wow. So, um, and I will say more info on this at a later date. But Harry has just made a great little uh, a great little deal with Unlimited for some extra content coming our way. So all will be revealed next month, I believe. Um, so Very exciting. Yeah, it's really, really good. Really good. I mean, Unlimited is just growing and growing and growing. I, I'm going to be filming Jamie's Down tomorrow. That's when we film the weekly vlog. Um, and I'm going to be filming another original for um, Unlimited, which I think will either go live next month or the month after. Um, it's a lovely little mentalism piece I've done for a while. It uses an old principle. Um, it's old, but may not be known by everyone, but I've taken it in a completely different direction. Um, yeah, so I will be talking about that and teaching that. Um, and, yeah, and so apologies we weren't here last week. We actually had the studio hired out by a corporate company um, and we were filming, and that's going to be happening like maybe once a month or something for the next few months because they've got loads of stuff they need to film. Uh, but we'll try and give you prior notice if we're not going to make a Tuesday. I'm going to try my hardest not to book them in on a Tuesday uh, anyway, just so we can do the lives. Um, so, a uh, couple of things. If you guys are signed up to Unlimited, Pop a little comment in the uh, comments here. Let us know how you're finding it. Um, Jamie's constantly working on uh, bits and bobs for it. So let us know how you're finding it. Are you enjoying it? What you're enjoying particularly about it as well? Let us know yes. in the chat. So um, if you're on Unlimited, get onto the forum as well because there's lots of interesting chats on the forum to go and check out and become part of yeah. so things like that only work if you use it and it's there for you guys to make use of so get on there and go and have a chat with people and share some ideas and ask questions and teach and do what you need yeah 100 percent. and jamie's working on a, a couple of new bits for the platform as well we're not talking about tricks or routines but like functionality bits um, he's constantly working on Unlimited. It's such a big part of Alakazam's day now, making sure that Unlimited is is always up to date with fresh new content. Um, for those of you that don't know, Unlimited is £4.99 a month. Um, it's a subscription service. You get access to everything the moment you join, and we add new videos every single week whether they're tricks, performances, interviews, um, there's always something new, including exclusives, which are effects that you can only learn on Unlimited. Uh, yeah. More great news as well. Last year, um, we released a stage effect called Bane by Jamie Dawes. Um, this year, we have got two or three brand new stage effects coming out as well. So we're, Alex Sam as a company now, we're releasing more products, but we're actually releasing products for different genres of magic. Whereas we were primarily close up, we're now moving in different directions as well. We've got some really nice stage stuff happening. 
Um, yeah, one of them I've been playing with, and he's brilliant. I can't be good when it comes out. Which ones? Uh, sorry, mate. You you you're cutting out uh, really bad. Is it? Did you say the one that you've been doing? Yeah. 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 I don't it's... Know. Do you know what? I might log in on my other computer. <clears throat> you do that. Let's see if that's uh, let's see if that's better. And I'll tell you what. While you're doing that, I'm going to play another trailer because uh, this is an effect that we've had a lot of emails about, and it's not a close-up effect. It's a it's a, a an effect for kids performers, I think. Let's take a look at that now because I've got Jamie Dawes ringing me. Hang on, here we go. Hi, I'm Gustavo Raleigh. For years, I've been developing an idea that I had it in my mind. Imagine blowing up a balloon, drawing a face in it, and after that, the magic happens. Hello, how are you? And that's not all. After using it, you could give it as a gift. Your balloon could sing a song or wish happy birthday. You might do ventriloquist with it. And besides this, you may combine it with many kinds of magic tricks. Imagine everything you can do with it. Two balloon, imagine it in your hands. Get to me now. So that was Toon How's that? Balloon. See, that's better. It is, it's because you're on yeah, wires. Yeah, a little bit close. A bit scary. You look huge compared to me, look. Hold on, I'll put it I'll put it over here. Let's see if I can get it. There we go. Is that a bit better? Uh mm, no. no, bring it down a bit. Hold on. Beautiful. There we go. Um, I just said Jamie trying to ring me, but I don't know. I couldn't get through. Um, so a lot of comments coming in, a lot of love for Unlimited. Um, also, Walter said, uh, Dad versus Lad is great. <laughs> well, I must admit, we have a lot of fun filming the vlogs, and I don't know how Jamie does it. He literally comes round on a Wednesday, that's his day in the office, and he gets all the week's content uh, filmed in that time. And uh, he comes up with these great little ideas like dad versus lad, educating Emma, and things like that, just to make the vlogs more interesting. Um, but yeah, he's absolutely great. Uh, Tom Rolfe said, I've got a 10 foot tall Wayne in my <laughs> living room, <laughs> scary to say the least. Uh, David, see if I zoom out. David Blair said, "I like Harry, but always want Pete to win, probably because I'm a dad as well." And the other thing is, as well, when I win, Harry does lose his temper, so it's always <laughs> fun to watch. <laughs> yeah, um, it's very funny. Um, and Lee said the dice to create the act with a budget is a great idea. Uh, it really is. My only issue with that, and I've told the boys, is I think the budgets are too low. So we're going to get a higher value dice as well. Um, because we really do want to put really solid acts together. And yes, you can put an act together for under a tenner because you just buy a pack of cards and a thumb tip or even just a pack of cards but you you don't want that you want to put a really good solid act See, if i said to you wayne even when you came in that time and you'd done the kids show one it was great but if i said to you you had 200 pounds or 250 you're going to put together a far better act than making do 
Yeah. Um, there was a really good comment as well that come in, and um, someone said it would be great if you'd done a video once a month of performing the act. So I think that's something we're going to do as well. The other thing that I promised as well, which I haven't done yet, which I need to do, is uh, film the routine using what happens in Vegas, Casino Con, and um, Jokers, and putting them together as a, as a longer routine. So I will be doing that. Um, and yep. a quick well, message well, to that, Tommy yeah. Burnett as well. Tommy, the samples are due in this week, just to let you know. Um, uh, oh, thank you very much, Lisa. Lisa said she's reached, recently purchased Bain. She's wanted it for a while and she absolutely loves, loves it. Um, it is such a great trick. I mean, Harry does it at all these stand-up gigs. I know Jamie's been doing it for a while. Um, and it is. It's so strong and it's so funny. Uh, Lee said, Harry's temper is in his Italian jeans. Uh, it, to be fair, that is, even though I very rarely lose my temper, but Harry has certainly got the Italian fire in him, <laughs> without a doubt. Um, so, Jamie, if you're watching, send me a message on Skype if it was urgent or even if you want to jump on. Uh, so, Wayne, tell us a bit about the shindig. Have the, ticket, the tickets have gone up now, haven't they? Tickets are on sale on my new shop page. I've got a new shop. So, it's wgmagicshop.com. Yeah. Uh, and, yes, and tickets are selling. So, we've only got 75 tickets. It's restricted to five people. Um, I've this computer, but we have sold. Um, don't look at the mess in the background. I've got loads going on over here. <laughs> yeah, you have <laughs> been sorting out the studio next door. You've done everything yeah, apart well, from is, getting yourself yeah, an to, Ethernet cable. I've got yeah, I've got trickle. I've got I've got that's all rubbish by the door. That's all going. Um, hopefully tomorrow when the bin man comes, that's all going from from beside the door there. Uh, yeah, just loads of stuff everywhere here at the moment. Um, but yeah, the ticket on sale and they're uh, they're selling um, so you can get them and i've got confirmed um and and i haven't actually announced this yet on the site but we have confirmed um martin pierce is going to do the feature and nice. we've got our very own andy smith doing the second lecture oh lovely lovely so, uh, as well as have, i think we've got five confirmed dealers there as well brilliant so yes uh, it should be uh, uh, another great, great excitement for it. So that's on the 8th, 9th and 10th of November. The day itself is the 9th, but the uh, you know, people come up on the Friday and stay till the Sunday. Brilliant. Brilliant. Good stuff. No, looking forward to it, mate. Looking forward to it. That's about it. That, hides, that hides all the junk behind me. Yeah, you should have warned me. The thing is, my dining now is it's lovely. My dining room is empty now. I've just got my camera stand and... Pitching, um, my camera is now on a shelf on the wall, yeah. so I can look at the screen and look at the camera at the same time, which is good. Um, and yeah, um, yeah, happy days. It's to get there. Yeah, lots of junk going, lots of stuff going in the bin. Good. Good. Let me see what's happening done. in here. I'm following Jenny's rules. If I haven't used it, it's got to go. Um, let's see what's happening here. Uh, there's a few people joined us. We've got S. Pryor, we've got Walter joining us, Coco's here, Lee Alex, Lisa Oakley, uh, Paul Morley, Magic Magic Man, uh, David, Tom, uh, Tommy, Roy, David. So welcome one and all. Um, Walter says, typical young Italian male temper, indeed. Um, and S. Pryor said, I've recently started using Envision again. Such a strong routine. So Envision uh, is an effect by Dave Loosely. We had it out, oh, five years ago? Six years ago? Um, Longer, yeah, it must be six, seven years ago. Yeah, and but we only had a very small amount and they sold out very, very quick. But the good news is it's coming back um, later on this year, maybe sort of September, nice. November. 
Um, so keep your eyes out for that. In fact, we've got a few new coin tricks coming out this year. Envision, uh, Envision being one, we've got a new coin trick coming out with um, Eric Stevens as well, um, which is beautiful, really, really good. Um, so that's coming out. We've just had the, the coins specially machined and everything else. Um, we've got a coin trick coming out by Pig Cake. We've got a lot of stuff happening in the, the coin area as well as the stage and mentalism and just so much good stuff. So much good stuff. And the extractor is coming back. And STC yes. is coming back. Extractor, I'm getting at least three players on the chat asking when extractor is coming back it well, is we had, one of the most anticipated releases for this year yeah well we had a, a bunch in last week and we sent out an email and they sold out within 24 hours we're getting another bunch in about two weeks time um but when as soon as you see the email or as soon as you get the the email saying they're back in stock grab one because we're only getting 200 units at a time um, and they're, they're selling out overnight so you need to uh, make sure that you get told straight away if you want one because otherwise you will miss out until the next run um, more good news one as very, well sorry Pete sorry Pete I was going to say one quick way of doing that if you fill it us on the product page you get an email to say they're put back in stock the minute the stock list is updated, which means before the email goes out to everybody saying, hey, guys, it's back in stock, you get an email before that email goes out telling you that the stock has been updated and, and it's back in stock, which means you will get the jump before um, before the main email goes out to, to everybody. Yeah. And all you've yeah. got to do is take two seconds to buy it for me box and click enter and you're done yeah takes a second yeah that's that's good that's a good point because that way as soon as the stock gets entered it's all automatic um uh s prior said i've been chatting with john from global magic on extractor sounds very very exciting um if you haven't seen the extractor in action it will blow you away uh, and it's not only the gimmick itself, but the routines you learn on that video are incredible. They really are incredible. I, um, I remember when it first came, and we've talked about this before, but there's that bit where you're with Spellman and he's larking about a little bit on the camera. And then you, you had him just look at a card and, and, and went into the pack and went straight in the pocket. And then you touch him on the head and he kind of goes, goes a bit wobbly. And he goes, oh, and then you go, it's a spade. And he just stops and looks at you as if to go, no, you haven't fished, you haven't done nothing. It's like that look of in, in, in to be. And you're like, yeah, and then he went spades or whatever. And he's so shocked by it and he's so yeah. taken aback by it. And for me, that, whenever I think of Extractor, that's the routine. That's the one thing that always pops to my mind. Yeah. It's here just being completely bamboozled. Yeah. And the, the other thing that really, I mean, we go into it a bit on the video, but when we put the new video up, there'll be a few more routines using this feature. And it's not really a feature we've pushed, but you can actually write a message on their card after they've put it anywhere in the deck. Um, and that's a really nice feature for a bit of um, either mentalism or using it as a fake psychology thing where you get them to, you know, literally go through the deck, choose any card they want, sign the card, put it back into the deck. And then you start writing something on a post-it note, give them the post-it note um, and then put the deck away in your pocket. Now, when you bring their, when you produce their card, you can turn it round and it will say on the bottom of their card, pick this card or pick me. And then you can go into, uh, you know, the sort of presentation where you say, now, 
In a moment, I'm going to tell you what card I believe you selected. Now, if I've got this right, there will be a, a reason why you selected it. Subconsciously, you wouldn't have noticed, but, um, sorry, subconsciously, you would have noticed, but consciously, if this worked well, you wouldn't have seen anything strange. Now, as you were going through the deck, I did tell you to take out any card that stood out to you. There was one card that should have stood out to you, and that was the Two of Hearts. And then they say, yes, it was the Two of Hearts. And I say, now the reason that stood out to you was because there was a message written on it. Did you see it? And they say, no. And then you show them all the other cards and all the other cards are normal. And the one that they've signed has actually got pick me written on it in Sharpie. Um, nice. So there, there's so many things that you can do with the extractor. Um, so yeah, uh, Sean Mann. The extracted tutorials are so good. Uh, so, uh, while we're here, I've got um, another couple of trailers to play. Uh, one of the trailers is a brand new addition to Unlimited. Uh, it's a new routine by John Carey. So, let's take a little look at that now. <laughs> Hi everybody, it's Johnny here. I've got Harry at Alex Sam. Great to see you, Harry, and you, and Peter, and Emma, and Andy. Uh, your little buddy, the dog's hiding he's around a, somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. We might get him in on a trick later. Maybe. Yeah, okay, so a deck of cards to begin mm -hmm. with. Look at that, JC does a flourish. Nice. 9.99. <laughs> Available at 12 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. <laughs> Shuffle the pack, sir. All right, I'll give him a mix. Yeah. Thank you, dokes. This trick's actually got a name. It's called Right Before Your Eyes. Okay. What's the name of this trick? Right Before Your Eyes. Remember that, because there will be a quiz later. Yeah? Okay. Oh, right. okay, okay. I'm happy. So what, if you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it, and you're happy and you know it, thank All you very right. much. Right. Coffee's kicking in, boys. <laughs> and girls, sorry. Um, I'm going to just riffle through the cards like that. You're going to say stop somewhere, yeah? Mm -hmm. yep. Ready? Yep. Stop. Just there, yeah? Happy. Yeah. Okay. And uh, I'll show you that card. Remember that card? Yeah, got it. Show it to the camera at home, yeah? Mm -hmm. Now, you could have had any of these cards, yeah? Yeah. We'll put your card down there. You could have had any of these cards, yes? Yeah. Okie dokie. I'm going to put the pack on top of your card. Hold your hand out flat over the pad. I'm going to put that down there. I'm going to do three things. First thing I'm going to try and do is hack your mind. I'm going to reach into your mind and pull out the thought of your card. Keep saying it over and over again, like... Four of hearts, four of hearts, four of hearts, yeah. yeah. Second thing I'm going to do is just cast a shadow over the cards. And like a ghost going through the walls of an old Irish castle. To be sure, to be sure, it's vanished. Nice. And the third thing I'm going to do is make that card appear right before your very eyes. Do you remember I told you at the beginning? Yeah. Not here, not there. Watch down here, your four of hearts right before nice. your very eyes. Nice. Very good. Thank you very much indeed. Thank very you, Harry. Nice. Very good. So that's right before your eyes. You can learn that right now on Unlimited. And I will say, we have got our good friend Anthony, Anthony Edwards joining us. Anthony's been unwell, so we're wishing him a speedy recovery, and I'm sure all the other fam do as well. Um, also, yeah, just to let you know... Nine hour, he was in a nine-hour operation yesterday. He was. So, yeah. But he's, he's in recovery. He's on the mend. I spoke, I spoke to him this morning in text, but... And Sarah, his wife, has been messaging me and keeping me updated as well. So yeah. Yeah, he's on the men's. Uh, yeah. Brilliant. Well, it's good to see him on here on the chat. And I know everyone will wish you a speedy recovery, mate. Um, also, just want to say this Saturday here at Anakazam HQ, we have got the legend Leo Schmetzers coming into the shop. He is giving a masterclass on the free shell game and Leo Schmetzers is a master of the free shell game, absolute master. Now, if you want to grab a ticket for it, there's only a couple of tickets left. Um, it's happening at two o'clock, I believe, on Saturday. So it gives you plenty of time to get down here. You can have a look around the shop, make a day of it. It's their 60 pound a ticket. 
there's a maximum of, I think, 10 people we're allowing in, um, and you're going to get tuition on one of the best effects you'll probably ever do. Um, all the props will be supplied for you to do it. I mean, not to take home, obviously, because they're, um, we're going to be using Leo's shells, but you will be able to buy them if you want to on the day, and I think Leo's going to have a special price on them as well. Um, but it will be a perfect time to learn this fantastic effect. I'm going to have a look actually to see leo is the master as well isn't he <coughs> he really is um i'm gonna have a look to see if i've got a video of it because he performed it in the shop years ago uh let me have a look let's have a look here da, 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 da. um Oh, he's just sent me a message. Who's that? Jamie Dawes. Oh, yeah. Tried to uh, in the live lecture next week, <coughs> beginning, but, but yeah, it was below there. Uh, apparently, lots of the Unlimited members don't know it's happening. So, uh, the live on the Unlimited platform, it's not going to be, uh, it's going to be available on there, isn't it? So, you're going to need to be an Unlimited member to watch it. What was that? I mean, Live lecture. Oh, the um, Simon, Simon Lipkin. Lipkin. Yeah, you need to yep. be an unlimited member. So, and it's it's included within your membership. So, your four pound ninety nine a month gets you access to that lecture as well. Um, and we are looking to do uh, unlimited lectures and masterclasses every two months. So, I think what we're going to do is we're going to alternate. We're going to have Every second month, we're going to have an Alakazam jam evening. Um, and not where we're making jam, obviously. It, oh, it will be. I thought that's what you meant. <laughs> yeah, you can take all the sugar and strawberries back now. Um, so we're going to have an Alakazam jam meeting, and that will be a place that if you're working on a routine or uh, you're working on an act or whatever, we can all help out. We're hopefully going to be doing it over Zoom. Um, but happening within uh, the unlimited platform. And then every second month, we're going to either have a special guest giving a lecture or a masterclass, and we've got a few uh, lined up as well. So I've just found this old video, <coughs> and this is an old loosely lowdown. Uh, let me see if I can bring it in. And if I can, we can probably play it. So bear with me one second. While you're looking for that, I'm going to very quickly say, if you haven't got it already, if you're new to the uh, to the lives, etc., make sure that you've got the Alakazam app. Lots of things that happen on there as well, and you will miss out if you're not. Uh, <coughs> you know, it's free to download on the App Store or the uh, Store, whatever it's called, the Android version. Um, so make sure you get the app. Uh, yeah, and that's it. Yep, and if you watch our vlogs as well, we do In It To Win It, and last week we didn't get a chance to because it was so late by the time we finished in here. But usually we go live before we do In It, in it To Win It. We go live on the app, so it gives you an idea of when we're going to be calling. So anyway, I've got this little video. Shall we take a look at this, Wayne? Look. Let's do it. Okay, ladies. Hello, ladies. Welcome in the Alakazam shop. Yeah, but let's start a uh, game with money. So I have here three small cups and one ball. Yeah? And a cup for you. Okay. So when you think the ball is on two, you put it on the top. Yeah. So Jenny wants to choose another one. Okay. Yes? And let's play for some money. Okay. Is it one, mm -hmm. two or three? Put them on top. Three. 
Yeah. Jenny, which one do you want? Uh, number one. Okay. Well, let's look. Yeah. Hope you want your money. So, yeah. Got that? Yay. Okay. <laughs> this is the money to go with you. Thank let's you. try it again. Let's try it again. There you go. You ready? Yeah. Start. Is it three, two, or one? Let's say it's. Do you want to change because the last time you was wrong? Do you want to change? No. You don't want to change. Put your money in. Which one do you want? Uh, number two. Put your money in. Look here. Oh, look. <laughs> Jenny. Ta-da! <laughs> ah, okay. Last one. Last one. Claire, look, look well. I do it very slowly. Very slowly. Is it one, two, or three? You tell me. Again. Okay. Lucky this time. Okay. Which one do you want? Put um, all your money in when you want. You can all put all your money in. All of it? Yeah, put it in. No problem. Hmm. You win all the time. <laughs> Number two. Two. Look about this. One. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Whoa. Look about you. <laughs> I'm sorry. Now is the money for you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you very much. So good such a good routine um, so Leo is going to be teaching that this Saturday at Alakazam HQ and if you buy a ticket to join us I think there's 60 pound a ticket um, you're, you're going to be getting you're in a small group Leo is going to be teaching exactly how to do the free shell game and there's going to be a lot of time for sort of personal one-on-one -on -one tuition as well because there's only a few people there but then afterwards as well, after the fact, you're going to be treated to an hour-long lecture by Leo Schmetzer's all within your ticket price as well. And you can have a look around Alakazam HQ. So make a day of it. And we have got the designer outlet two minutes away. So even if you're coming down with a partner and they don't want to come down and sit while you're learning magic, you can drop them off at the outlet centre they can have a walk around, do some shopping um, while you're learning something new. So it will be worth nice. doing. There's only a few tickets left. Beautiful. Beautiful indeed. Um, right, Anthony, right, there's a few questions come in. Uh, Philip Austin said, Wayne, good afternoon. Wayne, what coin do you prefer to coin roll? I've been using a two pound coin, find it difficult. Now I'm tr trying old half crowns. So I, use, uh, I can roll any coin basically, apart from jumbos. Um, but for, for just messing around with a coin, uh, this is a half dollar. But I can do two, well, I've got a two pound here actually. Hold on. Uh, it's a split two pound coin, um, but yeah, I could do a two pound coin as well. Oh, but not when it splits. Uh, it's not a very good split. It's not a very good split coin, but yeah, I can do a two pound. Um, I can't. I, I can do I've a five never really, I've never really learned a coin roll, which is really stupid. Um, I've never really. I've, learned yeah, one. I, I remember my friend Eric showing me this years ago. Film roll. Put your hand flat on the table. Mm. Put the coin on the on. So your hand flat on the table, and then you start like that. It's quite hard doing it up here. So yeah, you, you you learn to move like that, and then event, and gradually just get rid of the table. So then you can just um, and just take it. Yeah, I can sort catch of it. do it, but terribly. I know um, Andy, our very own Andy Smith. I think I'm sure he can do two coins. Uh, yeah, two coins isn't that difficult, and I can do. All right, uh, I should be able to do it on on both. No, I mean hands. two on the same hand. Uh, yeah, yeah, I can do two on the same hand. It's tricky, but yeah, you can. Oh, there we go. Not when I'm holding up high. Um, yeah, uh, the most I think it was um, probably burning three coins on each hand. Yeah, and yeah. Well. I'll learn it. I, I, I'll give you the advice I was given though, and it's the same mantra that I use for everything. Um, and that slow is smooth is fast. Mm. Talk about this all the time. Don't, don't try and rush it. Make it as slow as you can. Oh, it's hard doing up here. Do it as slow as you can. 
and then build up and then you'll get the speed because you've made it smooth yeah so slow smooth oh wrong do that and i know slow, when smooth. you're practicing there's going to be a lot of dropping of coins but um i think the worst thing i ever rehearsed or practiced was the top it oh god i used like to top it ball manipulation yeah top it juggling contact juggling card manips practice over your bed or over your chair yeah. drop it it will just be there and you can pick it up if you do it just normally it goes on the floor it rolls under stuff yeah yeah and the topic you're I'm actually com- throwing it backwards so i'm just chucking it to the back of the room every time <laughs> um uh actually sandy wilson said can we please get a tutorial on the coin roll on unlimited or an academy 100 percent, we can andy has got a coin course um i think maybe one or two of the lessons are already up are they uh yes i think they are um but he's done a whole coin course on uh for unlimited they're going to be coming out every month um and i'll get him to do one on the coin roll because i'll be interested in in learning that myself um, and also another thing I believe launches next month is lessons in acting for magicians um, by Simon Lipkin as well. And the first nice. episode of that, I believe, goes live next month on Unlimited as well. So there's a lot of good stuff happening on Unlimited. Um, uh, David said, don't, don't tell them about it's funny the outlet. With, um, Go on. It's in it. We uh, we weren't stressing, but we worked really hard. All the videos ready for unlimited, and behind the scenes, put going into getting all these videos like, ready to go. Um, and actually, a lot of the material going up there is new content. Jamie's really kicking it, and and yeah. and, and there's a lot of new content. When we didn't really, I mean, it's nice. We've got all the other we can we can put in. Uh, there's years worth, but um, yeah, we've actually got all the new content is actually really having a huge impact, yeah. um, which is which is just brilliant. Um, I remember that there's still more questions coming. Uh... Yeah, we're gonna. I'll get Andy to do a tutorial on the coin roll, and we'll get it on Unlimited in the coming months. Not a problem at all. Um, before we go, we're running out of time now. But uh, there's a product that's been out of stock for a very long time. Sold out in a few days when it was released, which was last year, I believe. Um, and they've just come back in the stock. So let's take a look at this. The idea has been around for over 250 years, cutting a person in half and then being magically restored. Grand stage illusions like this are distinct from all other types of magic. They are larger than life exhibitions of our will to accomplish the impossible. But what if you could perform the most iconic of stage illusions right in the palm of your hands? Welcome to Demi Deck. After 17 years of perfecting the design, award-winning magician Angelo Carbone is finally ready to open the curtains and reveal his latest masterwork. If I were to ask you, if you think of a classic magician, maybe on stage, what trick comes to mind? Sawing someone in half. Here, uh, we'll do it with you then, since you're asking. <laughs> you know, they go inside of the box, right, and then they lock them in, and they're trapped. I think you may know where this is going once you see this. Slice it in half. 
So now you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> We're gonna saw the lady I in half. I got hat sawing but me. Close up. I'm just gonna go right here. Usually it's the belly button. But right there, we're just going for the middle of the deck. Every single card, including your card. Here, let's see. Actually, it's not 52, it's 104 pieces. Now for the twist, I will reach inside and remove your card. What was your card? Queen of Hearts. <laughs> look, I'll put it back inside, close it right there, and look very carefully. I'll pull it out just like this. 104 pieces, now 52, all healed. How are they not in half? I'm gonna need to take a minute. <laughs> Every single card back to normal. Oh, oh my God, I only turned half. <laughs> That's crazy. Because I flipped it over when I took it out. One second, this is actually super simple to fix. Barely an inconvenience. And there you go, you can check that out. Grab your favorite deck and perform it as an opener, a closer, or as a standalone performance. So I'm going to put the blade on top like so. Now, can you push down on the blade? Can you see if you can pass it through the deck? No, it's impossible. Yes. Yeah, hard, yeah? Stuck. It's stuck. Okay. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to click my fingers, push the blade down like so. It's penetrated the pack. To prove it, you can see, cut the deck in half. Put it back again like so. Take the blade. And to prove they're solid, and you can take the cards, have a look at them one by one. It's impossible. For the first time ever, thanks to the incredible mind of Angelo Carbone, perform this grand stage illusion up close and personal. <laughs> Come on! So that's the demi deck, and we have Beautiful. got a few units left in stock. A lot of them sold out when Harry sent the email out, but we got a few units left. If you've been waiting for one, pick them up. It's a perfect way just to carry your deck of cards, so you can start with a beautiful piece of magic. And it is—it's so baffling, so baffling, um, and it looks amazing. Even when you're um, done. Even when you know how it's done, you see it in like a where it just looks so beautiful. Yeah, no, it's it's so good. So good. So guys, just want to remind you if you are a member of Alexam Unlimited on the 30th of this month, which I believe is is that next week? No. Yep. Is it? Or the week after? Uh, no, next week. I think. Hold on. We're uh, no, that's the week after, two weeks today. Right, what day is it, do you know? Tuesday the 5th. Right, so on the 30th, on Tuesday the 30th, we are going live in Unlimited. If you have a look at Unlimited, you'll have a button that says Studio Live. If you click in there, you'll see the holding page with a big picture of Simon Lipkin on it. That's where we will be beaming live at 7 o'clock BST on the 30th, I believe it is. Um, and then, but don't worry if you can't make the day uh, because it will be recorded and it will be added. It might not be added straight away. It might be added in a couple of months, but uh, we'll see. We'll see what the schedule's like. But um, it will be live for everyone to join us at seven o'clock BST live in unlimited and remember there's no extra fee for that you get it as part of your 4.99 monthly subscription um which is crazy if you ask me absolutely crazy <laughs> but there you go that's jamie and harry for you uh so that brings us to the end of this week's live it's gone very quickly it has gone very quickly um, when are you down again, Mr. Goodman? Um, I don't know. I, I've not got anything in the schedule, but I've got a small problem a couple of weeks mm -hmm. because I'm house-sitting for my ex-wife, oh. for Charlie's mum. So I'm house-sitting. So 
I won't be able to come down for the next couple of weeks because I would like to come down so but uh, and I won't be down for the end of the month but don't forget that the shop is open yes it is we've got a magic club coming down actually on that Saturday the end of this month um, also that's another thing if you do belong to a magic club and you want to do something a little bit different for one of your club nights let us know and you guys can come visit Alex and we'll stay open for you um, and we'll put on a bit of an evening um, you can come down you can watch the stuff being damned you can ask questions uh, we'll put on teas and cakes for you all so um, yeah you can come down just let us know uh, Uh, Sandy Wilson said, any update on the Craig Petty Mirage Apparition Nightshade Academy, Peter? Yes, there is. Uh, Craig was supposed to be with us. I believe it was going to be next week, but he said to put it off because he, he's, he has to fly out somewhere and do something. So we've got some dates. I'm just waiting for him to confirm, but I think they're in uh, either May or June. So he's going to be coming down for a few days and during one of those days, uh, we're going to be doing it, but we'll, we will let everyone know. Um, and that is it, Wayne. So, um, sorry, mate, you are, break you need to sort out that ethernet cable. Yeah, I, I do think I do wonder if they're doing work. It's not normally this bad. No, you've usually so got wonder, super fast speed. Yeah, I, I've got an Ethernet cable. This computer needs to be on Ethernet as well. So I'm gonna I'm gonna look at getting a smaller Ethernet cable for this. Um, and yeah, I will get them because I've got I can see two, two ports for them over there, so I can plug them yeah. in. Cool. Um, Anthony Povey, before we go, says, any update on the Svengali project by Craig Petty? Um, it's in the works, but I will say uh, we have got his Mirage deck project, which has been filmed and has been sitting next door in its packaging, ready to go for almost a year, if not a year. So that will be coming out first. Um, and that should be hopefully when he's down. And don't forget this month's live. This is a trick Gosh. that people have already been doing on social media. And it's called Evaporate. It is a beautiful vanishing deck gimmick. Absolutely insane. It was a bit of a, a, bit of a hit at Blackboard, wasn't it? Yeah, it, it was, honestly, it was one of those tricks where people were just coming up and going, have you got that vanishing deck thing? I saw Henry do it. it it's just brilliant. And um, Steve O. Watson has made every single gimmick by hand, and they are beautiful, really beautiful. Um, and when you think how much work goes into them, even... You know, we've had s certain bits specially printed. And, it, yeah, it's such a beautiful gimmick. It's really lovely. And you can make the deck slowly vanish down to one card, or you can make it grow to a full deck. It's really, really neat. So make sure you join us for that. We will be sending out information um, very soon. Also, if you are a member of Alex Am Unlimited, you will be getting an extra email tonight um, just giving you a few more details on uh, Simon Lipkin Live. So um, that's it. That's All exciting, it. isn't it? Really exciting. I've got to go next door because I've got work to do. I've got a week's worth of catching up to do. Um, but I'm as always, some... what are you doing? I'm doing some filming. Very good. For a new project? Um, yeah, a couple of little things. So I'm going to be next door. We should be fine for that. Um, cool. Actually, I made me think. I do wonder if I've got it set up for streaming or recording. You you wonder if you've got it set up for what? For streaming, for recording, not for streaming. Well, you're always going to see a good picture because you're just going into the computer. It's when it's coming out here. But when you checked your speed, it was really 
loads. Yeah, you I'll get these. I've got one coming tomorrow, and I'll yeah. see another one today. Drop some time. Cool. So. Right. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's fa uh, thank our co-host, Mr. Wayne Goodman, and thank you all for being part of the Alica fam. Remember, if you are on Unlimited, go and be part of the forum as well, because um, that's getting a lot of uh, sort of use at the moment, which is great. It's great to see you guys using it. And um, yeah, spread the word about Unlimited. The more members we can get signed up, the more content we can put on. And we've got some really exciting things coming as well. So uh, you guys are going to absolutely love what we have planned. 100%. Right, so I well, am we'll going to... Sorry? See you next week. Yeah, we'll see you next week. Um, I'm going to leave you with the trailer again for Toon Balloon. Thank you so much for joining us, everyone. Oh, one more bit of information. This is only going to be of interest to our USA family members, and that is Alakazam have now got our very own warehouse in America with our very own full-time US employee. So you'll find our service getting so much slicker, it should be seamless. Um, and even the live chat in the next couple of days will be manned out of UK hours, more US hours as well, um, by our US employee, who is not only great at managing the warehouse, but he's also an amazing magician who you will get introduced to very soon. Hopefully, we're going to have him join us briefly on launch nights just to show stock in the US and tell us a bit how everything's going. And you'll probably see him doing some unpacks on our Instas. So, we'll have to uh, see if we can get him on here sometime as well. Yeah, 100%. He never sleeps. So that's always a good, a good thing. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Bless him. Yeah. So, um, guys, if you are in the US, thank you so much for all your support. Um, we really wanted our service to be seamless, whether you were purchasing from the UK or the US. Um, obviously, there might be delays if you, you order something really random that we've got shipped from here to the warehouse to get it out. But um, when a product's launched or whatever, orders should go out same day. No more messing about with this uh, drop shipping company that couldn't do the one job they were employed to do. They say they had, they had one job. <laughs> one job. It literally is that one job. You got one job. Just post it. <laughs> we'll do the rest. <laughs> but yeah, we're, we're really, really pleased um, uh, with our new team member and we will be introducing him to you very, very soon. So, guys, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much for all your support. And thank you for being a member of the Alica fam. We really appreciate it. And I tell you what, we have got so much good stuff coming out in the next year or so. Um, so keep your eyes out on all our socials and our emails as well. And make sure you have the Alica Sam app because it is, um, yeah, it's great. So, guys... Uh, just to let you know as well, I'm going to leave you with a trailer of Toon Balloon. That's brand new in. Alexam USA will have it in the next few days. So if you order it, please be aware there will be a few days delay. Um, but it is in stock over here in the UK as we speak. So, uh, Wayne, thanks for joining us. Guys, thank you so much for joining us. We'll see you next week right here on the Alexam Live. See you then. See you then. Hi. I'm Gustavo Raleigh. For years, I've been developing an idea that I had it in my mind. Imagine blowing up a balloon, drawing a face in it, and after that, the magic happens. Hello, how are you? And that's not all. After using it, you could give it as a gift. Your balloon could sing a song. Lee, Lula.
और विश हैप्पी बर्थडे यू माई जूम एंड थ्रिलो क्विश विद इट एंड बिसाइड दिस यू माई कंबाइन इट विद मेनी काइंस ऑफ मैजिक ट्रिक्स इमेजिन एवरीथिंग यू कैन डू विद इट Tumbalun, imagine it in your hands.